Kids, we are heading off to the movies in order to watch Howler 7. But tragically, the movie is not meant for all ages. So we will have to keep you here under the watch of a babysitter. Cool. Who is it? Is it someone fun? Is it someone sciencey? Or someone goth-like? No, not goth like Lucy. You all will see. Oh, that must be her now. I'll get it. You know I don't even know why I have to have a babysitter. I mean I am only 14 for crying out loud. Well too bad. You are receiving a babysitter and that is final. And you better behave, or you will be grounded. Big 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 time Lynn. Yeah, yeah. Good. Hey everyone, this is Julia Howards. She will be your babysitter while we are gone. Hello. Yo. How do you do? Nice meeting you, miss. Hello. Welcome. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hello. Jeez, can you be any shorter, lady? Even Lori towers you, and she is only 18. Then shut up. No one is talking to you. Jeez, no need to be that harsh, Lincoln. God. Well, Julia, we will leave you with our kids. We will be back in a few hours when the movie is done. And sorry about Lynn. She is like that at times. Don't worry, I've dealt with troublesome toddlers before. Hey, I am not a toddler. I'm 14. Good. Anyway, kids, see you in about an hour. Behave for Julie. Okay. Bye bye now. Come on. So, girls. what do you seven want to do? I think I'm going to head up to my room to continue working on experiments, so if you need me, I will be there. Sure, have fun. So what does the six of you want to do? I want to watch Spongebob on television. Can we? Why, of course, Lily. We will watch Spongebob. Forget that. Let's head over to Rogue City Park and play some ball. Sorry, young lady, but your older sisters told me before I came here that the park is closed. So we will just have to remain here and watch Spongebob. Yay, we get to watch Spongebob. It's going to be a long day. Man, I'm starting to get hungry. Me too, Linky. You two are not the only ones. You know, I'm getting hungry too. I could eat anything right about now. Okay, you four, I will cook something. Do any of you wish to help me out in the kitchen? I'll help. We will come to Count me in. All right, cool. Come on, you four. Lynn, do you and Lily wish to help out in the kitchen? Pass. I don't know how to cook, so I will stay here and wait until you are done. Very well. Come on, kids, let's head to the kitchen. And Lynn, make sure Lily doesn't watch anything that is too violent on the television. Yeah, I'm not a baby. I know what to do already. Seriously, Lynn, get your act together. This is getting old really fast. Otherwise, I will tell your older sisters that you have been acting like a jerk throughout the day. Are we clear? Yeah, yeah, I get it already. Good. Come on, kids, let's go fix all of us something to eat. And seriously, Lynn, chill out, will ya? Jeez, this sucks. Why the hell do I need a babysitter anyway? I'm 14 for crying out loud. I should be more independent. I got it. I'll just walk myself to Rogue City Park. It may be closed, but who cares? I will shoot some hoops to kill the time. No one will ever know that I am gone. Lynn, you do realize I am sitting right next to you, right? I really need to stop talking to myself. This is getting stupid. No, duh. Forget about it, Lynn. You know the rules. Rogue City Park is closed. If you are caught, you will be in a lot of trouble. So what? It's better than sitting here and doing nothing at all, but watching stupid SpongeBob episodes. Hey, take that back. SpongeBob is not stupid. It's the best TV show in the world. If by the world's best show, you mean the most dumbest, then yeah, I can work with that. I'm heading over to Rogue City Park. You can't. You will be in big trouble in. I won't let you leave. Ha ha ha. And what are you going to do to stop me? You are only one. I am 14. Do the math squirt. Oh, I can. And I have ways. Uh -huh. And what can you do to give me a way? I would love to see this. This. <coughs> Seriously, is that the best that you can do? I'm gone. See ya, Lily. Uh -huh -huh -huh. And where do you think you are going? You've got to be kidding me. Told you I had ways. You little squirt. I swear once I get my hands on you, you're not going to be able to sit down for a year. Sheesh, Lynn. 
For a girl claiming to not be a title or you are sure acting like one. Shut up Lincoln, you are not helping this situation here. Now be quiet right now or it is wet willy time. I, I shouldn't have said that. Lynn, I can't believe you tried to sneak out of the house when your older sisters clearly told you not to. And above all of that you even threatened to give Lincoln a wet willy, which is disgusting. That's it we are calling Lori. Yeah right, like you know my older sister's number. Oh, I don't huh? No you don't. Very well. Let us test that theory shall we? Good luck, she is probably dialing some random number. Hello, no way. Two words, check, mate, Lori, I have terrible news. It's about Lynn. Oh for God's sake, what the hell has she done now? Well, first she started off by acting as a jerk most of the day. Then she tried to sneak over to Roga City Park. When you clearly told her not to, we found out and stopped it thanks to Lily's crying, but the nail that sealed the coffin is when she threatened to give Lincoln a disgusting wet willy. It's atrocious. Oh for God's sake, she is so going to get it when I get back home. Thanks for telling us. We're on our way. Bye. Well now, look who is looking like a fool now. Now we will wait until Lori and the Tohers return. Starch talking. Well, I was, well. Spit it out. Well, I. Well, it's like what I told you on the phone. She was a jerk throughout the day, tried to sneak out, but was stopped, and threatened Lincoln with a wet willy. Lynn, is this true? Wait, where are the others? They are fine. I sent them upstairs, so they wouldn't have to deal with Lynn's consequences. Oh, good. Okay, fine. It's true, okay. I just hate the fact that I have to suffer a babysitter at 14 years old, and I just wanted to be a little more independent for once. Is that too much of a crime? Thanks, Julia, for watching over our family. You may go now, and for putting up with Lynn's crap. Here is $50. Thank you. It was fun babysitting. You four have great kids with the exception of Lynn. Have a great week. Well, Lynn. I guess you now know what this means for you. Um, I get a free soccer ball? No, no, you are so oh 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 grounded 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 for over 11 trillion years. Now go to both you and Lucy's room right now. Wah 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 wah. Jeez, what a baby. And she wonders why she can't be treated independently and why she needs a babysitter to begin with.